is Wednesday, 26th of January. Yeah, I am right. And we're in Nassau today, so we've got we've got a virtual boarding route. That's how you have to do it. Now to get off the ship, you have to sign up at half eight for a virtual boarding route. So we're just waiting for our time to come down, where we can get off the ship. We've got a cafe and got some coffees, and we're just going to sit here and chill out, looking at the carnival ship opposite us. Uh, while we wait to be able to get off the ship and go and explore a bit of Nassau. We've got no, nothing planned, no port adventures or anything. We just want to go and have a look really and pick up a magnet that says we've been. <laughs> That's the plan for today. Oh, it's windy down here, but we are off the ship. There she is. It's only when you stand at the bottom of it that you can appreciate how large it is. <laughs> Oh my goodness. So we've also got in port a British Navy ship, yeah. Go on the Royal Navy. HMS <laughs> Medway. HMS Medway is in port with us. So we've made it out of the port. They're not joking when they say there are people everywhere trying to get you in their taxis and get you on their tours. We just kind of kept our heads down and just kept motoring and we're like, no thank you, no thank you. Yeah, no one was like chasing us down the road, but there was just a lot of people. Anyway, we want to try and find the Hard Rock Cafe uh, and get some free Wi-Fi. That's the plan. But we don't have any internet, so we're kind of like just walking blind <laughs> until we find something. So we found the Hard Rock Cafe, but it is shut down, isn't it? Yeah. Closed. But just across the road there is a Starbucks and you can see this is where everyone from the cruise ship is gathering because you can get free Wi-Fi in Starbucks. We've just done it so that we could uh, transfer some money over so that now we know we've got plenty of money for our last few days, didn't we? Yeah. Tapped into the emergency holiday fund. Standard. And we're going to go for a little walk down the front, I think. Oh dear, what happened to that car? <laughs> it's a bit battered. Yeah, we're just going to go for a little wander down. Bye, thank Fine, you. thank you. It's alright, I don't do jewellery, thank you. <laughs> Lots of people trying to sell you stuff. Kind of standard, this is a tourist trap, so it's what you get in any kind of tourist trap, isn't it? Yeah. You get the same when it, even places in Europe, like if you go to sort of, you know, Mallorca, down in... Um, Magaluf, you get the same thing, but they're, they're trying to grab you in their bars for drinks, aren't they? Yeah. Do you think they could have parked any closer? Jesus! <laughs> so we've found the straw market. Do you like a market? Let's have a little look. <laughs> so we're done in the uh, straw market, aren't we? Yeah. It's cool in there, there's lots of very good like gifts and stuff. Um, it's amazing, everyone had a sale on today, didn't they? Absolutely what every store. What a great day to visit. <laughs> Everyone's got a sale. <laughs> but no, it was cool. I bought we bought a couple of bits in there, didn't we? Yeah. Which is nice. But it is things it's like any market. Even in the UK it you go, be the market that used to be in real. Yeah, any market you go to you're gonna get people shouting out and saying, Come and have a look, looky looky, all that kind of stuff. Um but no one was overly pushy, were they? No, everyone was pressed. Everyone was very nice. So we're making our way back to the ship, aren't we? Yeah. We spent a good couple of hours just wandering around. Yeah. Done a bit of shopping. Um, we were never planning on doing much. Yeah, we weren't planning on doing much. But um, yeah, bought Got some bit. bought some bits, some souvenirs and all that kind of jazz. And it's very hot. It's and it's, lovely. it's only just coming up to 11 o'clock. We got our passport stamped as well. Yeah. Proof that we've been to the Bahamas. <laughs> we have stamps in our passports. Um, and now I think we're going to head back to the ship and just take advantage of the sun yeah. and uh, go to the pool, standard, maybe do the aqueduct while it's nice and hot. And yeah, just enjoy the afternoon before we've got um, our chocolate and liqueur tasting at four o'clock today. You must remember that one. Look at this mega yacht that's in port as well. That thing is huge. How the other half live, eh? <laughs> No. Uh, to be fair, we we feel fancy just being on the Disney cruise, don't we? We're like we're so fancy. <laughs> That's fancy. So over there in the distance, you can see the Atlantis, 
which is uh, like a hotel, casino, water park. We were just saying that if we were to do another cruise like this, where we came to NASA again, we'd probably want to go over there and go to the water park. Uh, now that we've had the experience of wandering around Nassau, I think I'd like to go over there yeah. next time. If there is a next time, we'll see. I'm sure there will be, because we're having a great time. <laughs> and there she is, the beaut that is the Disney dream. Oh, she's so gorgeous. Never get bored of looking at her. So we're back up in our room. There's lots of work going on down at the port. They're always having a big revamp, so it's quite noisy out here. But look how beautiful this water looks. I mean, oh, I could just dive right off there, but I won't because I'd die. But it is so, so beautiful. It is hot today. Very, very hot. I think it's like 26 degrees. I don't know because I don't have internet to be able to look. 24 degrees, my watch is saying. So warm. Thoughts on NASA? It's nice. It's a, it's a tourist trap. Lots of people trying to give you free uh, like friendship bracelets that you know aren't going to be free. Jewelry shops trying to drag you in but it was it was still cool to go and see. I'm glad we went and we did get some some bits and pieces from there as souvenirs to say we've been. I did get myself a little straw bag from the straw market because I thought it was super cute. Now we're going to um, get changed and head to the pools I think. Um, very much looking forward to going on the aqueduct again because uh, the water on there is very cool so I think that's going to be nice today because it is hot 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 so probably going to go get some drinks <coughs> from the um, like the free soda place and then hit the pool. <laughs> Back by the pool. <laughs> Standard. I just saw our stateroom host as I was coming up as well and he was like I haven't seen you. I always knock but you're always out. I was like yeah. <laughs> we're at the pool. <laughs> if you can't find us, we'll be at the pool. <laughs> so I think we're going to go have a little aqueduct. Aqueduct. Aqueduct is the other ship. Aqueduct. Duck. Because uh, I'm looking forward to that cool water today, although I might regret that saying that when we actually get on it. <laughs> I'm sitting at the front. so much fun. It's um, warmer than it was the other day. Yeah, the <laughs> first time we did it was freezing but it was really warm today and uh, we've just been to Flow 8 Cafe which has got a cheeseburger and fries again and I've gone for chicken tenders and fries today. We did contemplate going to Cabanas didn't we for lunch and then decided against it because it's too nice outside so <laughs> we just <laughs> got the staple burgers and chicken. Pool time also equals beer time doesn't it babe? <laughs> it's the afternoon. I was like, I don't think I've ever seen you drink as much beer as you have in these past couple of days in our entire relationship. And then I've got the drink of the day, which I can't remember what it was called, but it's like vodka, cranberry and pineapple, I think. We're going to give this a whirl. It's got some free ice cream. I've got chocolate and vanilla and Richard's gone for strawberry and banana today. Is it nice? We're just debating whether we should go up and try the other pool at the top. It's not really a pool, it's kind of like a chill out water area. <laughs> I don't think it would stay here. Just for a bit of a change. This has the pool. Yeah, it has the pool. It's very sunny up on the top. I don't think I'd be too keen on just sitting out in the sun. No. Stay here then. Huh? Stay here then. 
I'm just gonna say it. It's windy up here, so I don't know if you'll be able to hear me. <laughs> Speak louder into my god ear. <laughs> so we've just been chilling out the ball, chatting to some other guests, haven't we? Yeah. Being sociable, which is unlike us. Uh, but it's been great fun. And now we're gonna come and play some goofy golf. So you get two lines. One's Max's, one is Goofy's. Golf was fun very short little course but it lasted killed about 15 minutes and it was a tie wasn't it yeah, rich man. rich took a very early lead but fluffed it on the last hole so it was 22 each <laughs> they wanted to be in the mood for me beating her again when did you last beat me i whipped your ass at the mini golf in Walt disney world so i wouldn't i wouldn't i wouldn't be upset if you won this one because then we'd be all even we're gonna have a look in vanilla peas so all this is at an extra cost. Everything in here costs more, but it's very cool. Having our ice cream, no, no, it's all ours. <laughs> so we got some treats from Vanilla Peas. I've got two scoops. I've got a scoop of butterscotch and a scoop of toffee crunch explosion. And Rich has got and sour patch and candy, candy explosion. explosion. And then you've got Skittles, M&Ms, Reese's and Reese's pieces. I've only got M&Ms because he put the M&Ms on. Yeah, he, he meant the Skittles and he put the M&Ms on instead. And then I've got some chopped up Twix and white chocolate. And we're back in the room and we're going to enjoy these on our veranda. So this is pink. You're meant to be inside a champagne bubble. And this is our drinks for today. I see, I see bubbles, I see red wine. Probably looks like a, maybe a port or a whiskey. I don't know, it looks cool. I do like it in here, it's very pretty. The uh, lampshades are like champagne glasses. It's very, very, very cool. Chocolate and liqueur, liqueur tasting. And cheese. And cheese. Oh. So we had champagne, red wine, port, and a whiskey. And it was um it was good. I didn't like the red wine at all and I couldn't drink the whiskey. But I enjoyed the champagne and the port. Yeah. And the cheese. The cheese was so good. But what did you prefer? This one or the tequila and margarita? I prefer the tequila one. I think this was a lot more... I think that you've got a knowledge of wine anyway before you go into it. I think, that. yeah, it's, it's about pairing food yeah. with wine. And um, we don't really drink wine and stuff, so... It was good, it was interesting. Yeah. But um, I probably wouldn't do that one again. The chocolate was good. <laughs> the cheese. The cheese was good, but yeah, I wasn't a big fan of the um, alcohol offered. It's 
pirate giggly. Oh, pirate oh, he looks so cute. Oh, look at them all in their pirates' outfits. Downstairs, we've got pirate Donald. And then Daisy's over there. <laughs> <laughs> and we're back to the pool. There's a surprise. <laughs> Where else would we be? I was saying, I'm pretty sure these cruise vlogs are going to be really boring because all we've done is go to the pool. And been to Nassau. And been for a I didn't really film anything at Nassau though. I was afraid to get my camera out. Like, they were just, it was just a bit overwhelming in Nassau, so I didn't want to get the camera out and really film anything. But we're going to Castaway Key tomorrow, so hopefully that'll be interesting. Yeah. Hopefully. <laughs> that <laughs> that's our sea creature for today <laughs> with chocolate coins so we are showered and we are ready for the unofficial pirate night but we're gonna pick up some last few bits in the shop while we still know we've got money <laughs> before we run out <laughs> never get over how quiet this atrium is every time we seem to come through it it's like you look at other people's vlogs and um, it's always rammed in here, isn't it? Yeah. And now it's so quiet and so peaceful. And so beautiful. We're having a party. But no one's up here. <laughs> oh, what'd you get? An Esquire. Ooh. Rum with all red wine. Wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, find out what you need. This guy's a sunshine guaranteed. Oh, look at that. Thank you. We go, best barman. <laughs> this is a bon voyage. Yeah. Ready for fireworks. I'm still the only cruise boat in the world that has fireworks. Oh, you see a cruise ship over there in the distance. Can't quite pick it up on the camera. Just there. Well, that's probably the carnival then. The carnival's kind of been stalking us all day. So I'm wondering if. Far out, sir. Do you know? They might see it. Yeah. I know there might be some other cruise ships about stalking us, trying to watch the fireworks, but very excited to be watching the fireworks at sea. So I had a moment earlier when I was, I was sat on one of the top decks just watching the sun go down. I was like, I'm on a cruise ship in the Bahamas watching the sunset. I'm like, what is this life? <laughs> Who gets to do this? It's amazing. Uh, and now we get to watch fireworks. <laughs> Come on! Look up to the sky, where once upon a time leads to Disney Ever After! Just watched fireworks off the ship, had a bit of a dance party, and now we're going to dinner. Fritz is going for a pee. So it's pirate night tonight, so we had crush and everything last night, and now it's all piratey, and everyone's dressed up in pirate gear. We have bandanas. Yay! Although I am slightly concerned, there's like nothing on the menu that I fancy eating tonight. Uh, so, see how it goes. I will probably be ordering mac and cheese off the kids' menus, because I'm that person. <laughs>
a bread service for tonight is Johnny Cake, otherwise known as cornbread. And we've got a mango dipping sauce. I do love a bit of cornbread. <laughs> appetizers, I haven't ordered anything. Because <laughs> there was no appetizers at all, even on the kids menu that I wanted to eat. But Rich has got crab cake and samosas. We were both saying we wanted to try the crab cake. Yeah, I'll, gi um, I'll give it a go and see what I make of it. We've no, I've never tried crab before. Normally, hence why we're trying it. So I've tried the crab cake. I'm not a fan. Um, yeah, I, don't, I like fish cakes and stuff, but I don't know. It's not horrendous. Like, it's not spit it back out. I can't stand it, but it's not not my kind of thing. Rich, like it? Yeah. Rich likes it. Hey, yo, I started like vlogging what we had for tea, but um, we were really interrupted by this uh, band of pirates. So I've got Jack's Treasure of the Sea, which is shrimp, scallops, and pasta in a tomato sauce. I tried the scallops. I, I normally quite like scallops, but these aren't cooked the way that I like them cooked, which is pretty much drowned in butter. Um, yeah, they're not, not to my taste, and I'm not a fan of shrimp, but I really wanted the scallops. <laughs> and then Rich has uh, demolished his, but what was it? Roast beef and... I can't remember what it's called. Oh, it's like a strip or something, wasn't yeah, it? He's having a look. Bear with. Bear with. Bear with. King George's Roasted Privateer Strip Boy. Okay, and it came with the Yorkshire pudding. <laughs> Is it good? So how was your pirate night meal? Alright. Roast beef. Yorkshire. Beef and Yorkshire pudding. <laughs> Mine, yeah, like I said, I was not a fan of the scallops. <coughs> and um, I don't really know how to eat shrimp. <laughs> so, but the pasta in the sauce was lovely. <laughs> that was right up my alley. I think this has been my favourite night. What, food wise? No, in like the venue. Yeah, it has been really cool with all the artwork, the pirate artwork, and then the pirates running through was fun. We are skipping dessert tonight because... We had vanilla peas earlier. We had like the free ice cream earlier, and then we had vanilla peas. So we're kind of like sweet treated out, although we are probably going to go back to the room. We were going to go out down to the adult bar for the evening, um, but then we both it's decided... Karaoke. We, yeah, it's like karaoke tonight, which is not really our thing. And we're both really quite tired and we want to make the most of our time on Castaway Key tomorrow. So we're going to head back to the room for an early night. Probably order some hot chocolate and some cookies. <laughs> That's the plan. I just love this deck. I think this is my favourite deck just to like have a little walk around. Because you can really imagine you're like on one of those classic liners of like the 20s and the Titanic, the Titanic which is apart what from lifeboats. yeah apart from we've got plenty of lifeboats uh, but this is what we're in the um, making of the dream tour that we did um, they said that this the Disney cruise ships were actually modeled on the Titanic which is unfortunate in a way but makes for a very well, beautiful that was the ultimate cruise line, wasn't it? it was yeah it does make for a very beautiful deck though. <laughs> Rich wants to play shuffleboard. We have no idea how to play shuffleboard, but he wants to play shuffleboard. <laughs> you get a quarter thing each. It reminds me. <laughs> it reminds me of like um uh what is it, curling <laughs> but on a ship. <laughs> like red or blue? Uh red please. I'm playing shuffleboard. Yes. I lost spectacularly. 35 to 7. <laughs> but, four it, ends. but it was fun. And now to bed. Hi. We've resumed, assumed the position. <laughs> We've assumed the position. For... Sleep. <laughs> 
So yeah, we're going to close off today on Nass Day at Nassau. Another lovely day aboard the Disney Dream. We only have one more full day left. Yeah. Two more sleeps. Two sleeps. Then we have to go home. Home, home. Home, home, yeah. Sad times. But it's all right, we've got Castaway Key tomorrow, which is going to be an epic day. I cannot wait to finally step foot on that island. Oh, yes. It's going to be amazing. So, yeah, tomorrow we've got the getaway package so we've got floats snorkeling mm -hmm. equipment and bike rental haven't we yeah so hopefully a good day we're gonna do well we'll see how we feel when we get up but we want to try and do the unofficial castaway key 5k because they don't do it anymore um but we spoke to guest services and they said you can run it or walk it come back and say that you've done it and if they've got medals they will give us one if not you can buy them in the shop can you in the castaway key shop yeah oh, okay. not on this i'm not on board but on in the castaway key shop you can so yeah that's our plan for tomorrow i'm gonna probably put my c-bands on because it's really rocky and i'm feeling a bit it's it is really rocky tonight isn't it yeah because we're not going anywhere yeah anywhere. it's it's yeah it's not it's not pleasant i haven't had to wear my c-bands all day because obviously we've not moved because <laughs> we've just been in port um and i haven't had to take on sickness since like last night but i've had to take some now we are doing less than one knot so yeah we're not going nowhere fast but it's just very rocky we're gonna call it a night thank you very much for watching guys have a magical day we'll see you really soon bye Days on